welcome to the induction ceremony on this fine April day. Uh, we are uh, inducting new members into Alpha Lambda Delta National Honor Society from 14 chapters this afternoon. So we're very excited about that. You can see all the institutions, uh, colleges and universities on the slide. Uh, so welcome to all of our 14 uh, institutions that we're inducting today. My name is Eileen Merberg and I'm the Executive Director of Alpha Lambda Delta. We are headquartered in the Rochester, New York, Western New York area. Uh, and uh, so happy that you're all here and we're excited about this afternoon. Co-facilitating with me today is Bradley Taylor. Hi folks, it's great to be with you and wow, what an awesome turnout today for a very celebratory occasion. Um, as Eileen said, I'm Bradley Taylor and I have the privilege of serving as a chapter advisor at High Point University located in Central North Carolina. And also I serve as a national professional member at large on our national council. And so it's uh, always a great privilege to be a part of these induction ceremonies and especially with you today. Great, thanks for being here. Uh, okay, so I like to give a little bit of an overview of what we are going to do today. If you're curious about how long this lasts, it typically lasts about a half an hour, about 30 minutes you can expect. Uh, so around 3.30, we will wrap it up. Um, we uh, go through a process to induct all new members and you're going to see your name uh, appearing on the screen. So keep an eye out for that. Uh, we're going to watch a brief video from our National Council, about a four-minute video from our national organization welcoming all new members. I'm going to spend just a minute talking about the benefits, uh, both nationally and Bradley will talk about the benefits um, locally on your campus or things to um, think about uh, to get involved in locally, and then we'll close it up. So that is our ceremony today. Alpha Lambda Delta honors high academic achievement in the first year of college. The purpose of the organization is to encourage superior academic achievement among students in their first year in institutions of higher education, to promote intelligent living and a continued high standard of learning. ALD assists students in recognizing and developing meaningful goals for their roles in society. And Alpha Lambda Delta was founded as an honor society in 1924 at the University of Illinois by the Dean of Women, Mariah Leonard. It soon became a national organization as chapters were established at Purdue University in 1926 and at DePaul University in 1927. Growth of the society has continued with almost 400 chapters recognized today. So today, these candidates who are now presented for induction have attained that high standard required by Alpha Lambda Delta, and they are worthy to be recognized by both their institution and ALD for their notable achievement in scholarship. We are here to inform the inductees concerning our organization, and we're going to ask you to take the pledge to make the best possible use of your education. The initials of our name stand for the Greek words Aleloi Lampedia Diadosisin, which stands for the motto, we shall pass our torches on one to another. The insignia of Alpha Lambda Delta represents the lighted candle. The golden base of our candle signifies honesty and integrity, which are the foundation upon which we build. The shaft of our candle signifies strength and courage. The light of our candle signifies truth and wisdom, which can dispel ignorance and superstition and give us the insight to live well in our time. The red represents the burning flame of knowledge. The white represents the search for truth and the gold represents the strong base of honor. These, our three colors, symbolize the standards held by members of Alpha Lambda Delta. Your education is the means by which you learn to recognize the wonders of science, to appreciate the beauty of great literature and art, to use well your own language, to learn the lessons of past history, to speak and read the languages of others, 
to study the social and political forces of our world and to discuss the thought and the philosophy of other ages. Through these means, you can evaluate the forces and standards of your generation and learn to live significantly. We now wish to induct individually the students who have earned the privilege of becoming members of your institution's chapter of Alpha Lambda Delta. Everyone is muted already, um, but wherever you are, you can repeat these words uh, if you would like. The Alpha Lambda Delta Pledge. I accept membership into National Alpha Lambda Delta, understanding that in doing so, I assume the responsibility of continuing to maintain its standards of service, of diligence, and of integrity. I pledge to promote high scholarship and to use my education for the benefit of my community, my nation, and the world in which we live. Okay, so this is the fun part. Not that it's all not fun. We are going to slowly advance through slides for each chapter and all the inductees. Uh, and so when you see your name, we're gonna ask you to type in the chat. When you see your name, uh, type I accept.
congratulations. Oh, Everyone give yourself a round of applause. Um, you have now recorded your induction into Alpha Lambda Delta on this, the 18th day of April in the year 2021. We give you a huge congratulations. This is a great accomplishment and you should be very, very proud. May you find in the years ahead uh, the rewards of an educated person. Imagination, adventure, humor, compassion, and understanding. May you have acceptance in your dealings with all persons, generosity to giving uh, to those in need, and insight into the feelings of others. In relating your education into the world in which we live, you can make a meaningful contribution to society. So again, we give you a huge congratulations. Congratulations, new members of Alpha Lambda Delta. Welcome to our organization and congratulations on your hard work this past semester. It's truly paid off. Congratulations on your induction into Alpha Lambda Delta. Hello and congratulations on your academic achievement. May today be the beginning of your journey with Alpha Lambda Delta. We are here today, first and foremost, to celebrate your accomplishments what you have been able to do as individuals. So I'd like to speak to a couple of you in the room. Uh, typically in my induction ceremonies uh, here at Western, uh, students typically fall in two buckets. I don't want to generalize or overgeneralize, but allow me to speak to at least two audiences, and some of you may fall out inside the margins here. First, a lot of you graduated, with, graduated high school with all the expectations in the world that you are going to do tremendously well in college, and that's outstanding. Hope you feel validated. You should. All the accomplishments, all the hard work you did in high school, all of that led and prepared you for college success. And today, you're here because you've earned that. I'd also like to talk to the students who may have been a little bit more like me, who college sounded great coming out of high school, but I doubted myself. I doubted my ability. Uh, I wasn't sure if I could uh, stand alongside other college students and, and, and earn the same grades as them. And overall, it's just scared of failure. Let's be a little bit honest. But guess what? You're in here with all the other folks that have those high expectations for themselves. And nobody's experience is better or worse than the others, but I hope you take a moment to appreciate that. You are exactly where you belong. You're in the room. You made it. You're here for a reason. Induction into ALD is a noteworthy accomplishment. Not only have you earned membership in this preeminent honor society, but you did it during what is arguably the hardest year of college. First, I work with hundreds of first year students every year. I impress upon each of them the importance of community, finding purpose. I explain the value of mentors, professional development, and service to their local communities. Your home chapter will provide you with all of these things and more. I have little doubt that membership in AOD will be the first of many accomplishments and accolades earned on your path to graduation. Get involved with your chapter. Explore the leadership opportunities offered also take some time to explore the variety of resources on the Alpha Lambda Delta website. Seek out opportunities that will allow you to build on your skills and ones that will allow you to give back to the community. Take full advantage of your membership in this National Academic Honor Society. Congratulations on your achievement. You have joined an amazing honor society and kudos to you for all that you've accomplished so far in your college career. Alpha Lambda Delta, or we like to call it ALD, is filled with some amazing opportunities just for you. So make sure to get involved. I hope you take the time to learn about what the national organization and more importantly, what your chapter has to offer. Participate. Connect with others from different disciplines that share a common level of intellectual curiosity. Engage. Participate in a service project, whether it be assisting others in their first year transition or a community campus service project. Give back. Lead. Get involved with your chapter by sharing your ideas, your talents, and your skills. Inspire. Consider taking on a chapter leadership role. Participate in ALD webinars and develop those leadership skills that will serve you well beyond graduation in your personal and professional life. You have a fire inside you, and now is the time to shine. Congratulations, and welcome to Alpha Lambda Delta. Congratulations. Welcome to the Alpha Lambda Delta family. Welcome to our organization, and again, congratulations.
Okay, congratulations again. And thank you to the National Council for uh, those great inspiring words and encouraging words, including featuring Bradley. Great, okay. So um, I'm gonna share information in the next couple of slides specific to your chapter. So if you are on your phone, take a screenshot. If you're on a computer or laptop, get your phone out and take a picture or jot down notes because uh, you'll wanna know since there's 14 chapters participating today. So one of the many benefits of membership, first and foremost, is a certificate hand uh, custom made with your name on it and a little pin uh, for your lifetime membership in Alpha Lambda Delta. Uh, so because of the pandemic and we're online, uh, you'd normally be in a room and you'd be handed a certificate at a ceremony, but because we're not doing that, there's all sorts of ways we're gonna get certificates to you based on your chapter. So uh, I'll just quickly go through these, but maybe take a note. Um, for some, you'll be able to pick them up uh, this semester. Some are gonna hold them to the fall. Some are getting mailed to you, uh, combinations of all that. So take note of your university. If you are not sure who your chapter advisor is, uh, mark this website. Um, I'm going to talk about our website in a minute, um, nationalald.org uh, chapter list, and that's going to list every chapter with their um, advisor's name and email. So if you do need to reach out or get in touch with your chapter advisor on your campus, make note of that website and, and look them up if you don't already know them. Okay, so here's the first four. Uh, here's Heidelberg, Illinois, Western Carolina, Murray State, and Ohio State. Uh, so again, for some of them, you're going to hear from your advisors. Uh, thank you, Bradley. The chapter list is in the chat. Very handy. Uh, okay, so take note of that. You'll see at Illinois, you can pick them up um, before April 30th. Uh, Western Carolina, you can pick them up. And then lastly, Stockton and Nichols are getting theirs mailed home. And Jackson State, Montana State, and Georgia are going to hold till the fall. And that'll be, you know, hopefully in the fall that we're all back in person uh, and people can gather and you can gather with your chapter. Uh, so let's hope for that. Okay, so that is for your certificate and PIN. Uh, I'm going to go back to the website, uh, as I mentioned, and just, uh, just I'm going to take a minute to review some things. I'm not going to read you uh, really anything other than to just point out where you can go uh, later and, and look. There's a lot of information on our website. So our web address is nationalald.org. Uh, so this is our main website. One of the first things that we get asked a lot about is our scholarship program. So check that out, uh, backslash uh, scholarships. We have three scholarships that we give out, uh, one undergraduate that you'd apply for next year, uh, Stemler Study Abroad, and then Graduate Fellowships. You are a lifetime member as of now uh, for to Alpha Lambda Delta. So in 20 years or 10 years or five years, if you want to pursue graduate studies, you can apply for a graduate fellowship through ALD um, and for the rest of your life. <clears throat> the other thing I want to point out here is our external scholarship link. This has a lot of other scholarships not ALD related that you're probably very eligible for. They're looking for high achieving students and there's all sorts of scholarships out there. So I would encourage you to look for them. A very unique benefit of ALD membership is called ALD Perks. And it's a discount program with about 300,000 discounts and um, perks from all sorts of businesses, restaurants and pizza and movie tickets and oil changes and uh, all sorts of things. It, uh, it's unique to ALD. It's a benefit that comes with your membership. You do need to opt in by just letting us know you want this, and then you're going to get a link to download an app. Uh, but that is our ALD Perks program. It's free, comes with your membership. Why not? Uh, another uh, very unique thing that we've developed exclusive for ALD members is our leadership certificate program. So if you have an interest in developing your leadership skills, you want to have an edge, maybe be more ready for careers and uh, or internships or job interviews, um, check out our leadership certificate program. It's a series of courses that you'd participate in or take uh, online. It's all online, self-paced. It could be a summer thing you want to do this summer. Um, there are 12 topics to choose from. If you do complete 10 out of 12, you will be issued a national certificate. 
uh, these are the topics. Um, I think you'd find them really interesting. We call them courses, but they're really like workshops. They're each about, they would take you about 30 minutes each one. Um, but uh, check out the ALD LEAD certified. Two more things I wanna mention is our career conversations. We have a lot of great alumni, over a million alumni over the years, uh, but we've gotten in touch with a bunch of them based on their major and the careers they're in and interviewed them. Uh, these were live at the time, but these are all recordings now. Um, but you might want to check these out. These are all Alpha Lambda Delta alumni who are successful in their field and doing some great things. And they talk about their path from first year to career. And then the last thing I want to mention is our partnership program. These are, uh, a lot of them are internship programs like in Washington, D.C. or internationally that are offering scholarships uh, and discounts for ALD members. Uh, Magoosh is a test prep program. Scholars is a great program that matches you. You create a profile and it matches you with jobs and internships. Again, these are all free benefits uh, to ALD membership. So again, it's all on our website at uh, nationalald.org. And then, uh, of course, what, what would uh, a ceremony be without a request to follow us online? Uh, in your chapter may have uh, also accounts with, uh, you know, posting things on uh, Instagram and Facebook, but um, we'd love a follow. We have a lot of content, particularly on Instagram. And in about 35 minutes, we're going to drop a post welcoming all of you and naming all the chapters uh, today for today's ceremony. So that'll, I think, 4 p.m. Eastern time, uh, that'll get posted on Instagram. So follow us on Instagram and, and at, we're always at National ALD. Uh, I did invite chapters to um, send me some information. Um, so this is just a little bit from Central Arkansas. So if you're from Central Arkansas, you can look for uh, lots of great activities they do. They, they, did, uh, they do a bowling night and movie nights, um, finals kits uh, they put together. Uh, and then this is your chapter president, Jaden Carter. Uh, and maybe take a quick screenshot of his email uh, or their email um, and some great pictures from activities they've done. So this is a good segue to talk about the uh, benefits at your local chapter and the importance of getting involved. So Bradley, I'm gonna have you say a few words. Thank you, Eileen. You know, all of those different things that Eileen talked about are just phenomenal opportunities that you can take advantage of in ALD. Um, but also one of the great ways to really um, take advantage of this membership opportunity is to be involved locally, right? You know, get involved in your chapter. Uh, many of our chapters all over the country and including an international chapter, um, really get involved. They host programs, whether that be community service events um, in their local community, even on their campus. Um, they host opportunities to connect with faculty or staff, kind of as a professional development opportunity. There's also some great social networking programs, uh, movie nights, you know, different things to bring chapter members together. And all of that is open to you. Um, and so the biggest piece of advice that I can give is get involved. And also, some of you may want to get involved beyond just being a member. You may want to uh, step up and hold a leadership role within your chapter, or you may have a creative idea for a new program or opportunity uh, for each of your chapter members to connect with one another and grow um, together or have a new experience. Uh, a lot of the different things that Eileen mentioned, uh, my chapter also has programs centered around. We talk about scholarships and we talk about, you know, how to write a good uh, application for a scholarship. And we have that as an activity. We also have done some great service opportunities and, and connected with many of those um, programs like ALD Leads and kind of done a promotional overview of that during chapter meetings. So uh, you can make the most of this opportunity 
but it's all about getting involved. If you don't know what's going on, ask your chapter advisor. Um, get involved with uh, communication. So follow them on those social media channels. Reach out and attend that next chapter meeting um, because this experience is going to be what you make it. And remember, this is just the beginning. It's all up from here. There's so many ways to get engaged. And so very simply, my piece of advice to you is get involved and find what fits you best. Um, take a friend, right? Um, that's the best way to do it is have the buddy system. So take one of your fellow inductees and say, hey, let's get involved in ALD and make a difference on our campus. And so we hope that you have a wonderful experience. Um, certainly a huge congratulations um, because you would not be invited if you didn't already achieve some great things in your college experience thus far. Um, but there's so much more ahead and ALD can be a part of that. So again, we extend you a huge congratulations today. That actually does conclude our ceremony today. Thank you all for being here. Congratulations again. Um, we had a great turnout. I'm so glad to see all the family chat uh, comments, loving it. So really appreciate that. It's really great to see such uh, great family support. So thanks all for coming. Have a great afternoon.